So after a long wait, Mob Psycho 100 Volume 5 is here at last, and this video is one month late. The reason being is because the website I usually order from had a cyber attack. All the other websites basically sold out, so I had to wait even longer to order this. But now it's here, we can finally get on with it. So we've got Mob activating his powers under the moon with trees. Here's the back. Same forest, and we've got Dimple. It's nice to have a another character at least on the cover and here's the side just had to close the blinds because it's hard to see first when you open this up you get the seventh division leader and all the chapters and yeah we get an omake a bonus chapter it's been a while since we've had one of them i think two volumes since and we just get the beginning with this whip guy just being interrogated Volume 5 contains the first claw arc and yeah, the end of season 1. This whole entire volume is just about that. So we've got like the flying calf, how the characters get to the villains, with this whip guy coming back to fight and him using his middle fingers because you know, that's all good. And how Ritsu and all the other amateur espers try to escape their imprisonment. Mob, Taruki and Dimple will split up to different areas of the division base. So compared to all the other volumes, this is a very battle heavy volume. It's a lot more fighting going on than the previous volumes. And I'm sure you've seen this if you've seen the anime. Where Mob thinks Ritsu is dead, but he's not. And that is just a great face. I do like how it has all the scars in every chapter of the side, where it's not got panels. And talking about the scars, this volume mainly introduces all the 7th Division scars and the 7th Division leader, Ishiguru. Oh yeah, and we also get an introduction to show the boss's son. Taruki learns the middle finger whip technique. Dimple possesses a body of an unconscious security guard to sneak into the building. And we get a rematch, but it doesn't very much last very long. Like last time, he just gets trashed. And it leaves us on a cliffhanger. Truki is kidnapped, Mob falls for a trap and goes unconscious. And Dimple's been captured by this guy who takes spirits for pets. And the biggest one of the volume. Thinking Reagan is the boss of Claw when he's really not. And you're making this is pretty cool. I'm so glad we got to have another one. It's how Dimple reformed after Taruki exercised him. This little pig ghost that's trying to get him. And we get introduced to this weird little spirit called Lazy Beard. He's basically boring and sleeps a lot. And Dimple just ditches him. And that is that, and we get a message from one. With all this in adverts. So that has been Mob Psycho 100 Volume 5. Sorry this one's quite short. I didn't have much to say and... I didn't want to, I don't know, go too deep, deep into it. Um, yeah, this is worth getting. Hopefully you enjoy if you ever decide to get this and have a read for yourself. But yeah, that'll be it for this video. I'll see you in my next one. Goodbye.